Hi, this is Paul with Hive Solutions. In this video, we're going to talk about using reporting inside the admin console. Reporting in G Suite is incredibly easy. From the admin panel, we're going to click on Reports so we can track usage of some of our services. Right up the top, we do see our highlights, which shows us how many emails have been sent, video hangouts, how many documents are shared. We can get user statistics, as well as who's getting close to that storage limit. On the left hand side, we have all of the different reports that we can create. For example, here we can do an aggregate report to get information such as two-step verification and account status. Under security, we can see who's enabled file sharing outside of the domain. So it looks like there are two documents from Mary and 12 from Roger that are stored or shared outside of our domain. Also inside, we can view account activity, so we can see when people have logged in or if they haven't been logging in for a while. The most important thing we have here are audits. Inside our audits, we can look at such as administrative audits, so we know everything that's happened inside our domain. Here, it looks like chat was changed to false in accounting by Roger. Emily was also changed to accounting. We can see an org unit was created, and the calendar resource has been created. Here we can check all the different information so we can see what has happened inside our organization and by whom. If you'd like to get a little bit more specific, we can always search for a specific event name, only info from a specific user, only a specific admin, as well as only a particular date range. These reports can also be done by who's logging in, which SAML apps, calendar, tokens, groups, or an email log search. If you have Google Apps Unlimited, you can also do drive reporting. If you don't want to go through and manage these reports on your own, you can create an alert to be notified when certain settings are changed.